If you guys did not see my post about calorie cycling, I'm definitely going to talk to you about it now. But calorie, especially carb cycling, is needed for the longevity of your client's weight loss programs and for their metabolism. You don't carb cycle just because you get stuck. All of our clients that we coach and all of the coaches that I mentor in macro mentorship, we teach them to carb cycle their clients as soon as possible. It's not something you do when you're not losing weight. It's not something you do because you're losing weight too fast. This is something that you should do to actually optimize your metabolism and increase your adherence to eating in a caloric deficit. If I had to be in a deficit seven days a week for three months straight, I would be miserable. But if I knew that on Saturday and Sunday, more calories were coming, I would probably do a better job. No one gets a medal for eating in a deficit for three months straight. You do get a medal for dieting smarter and macroing responsibly. So I'm not all about coaches that are putting clients on 1200 calorie diets till the end of time. I'm all about helping clients get there in a safe way and in a happy way where they can eat more food. Flexible dieting does require days to be higher in calorie and carbs for you to be able to eat the pizza that you see people have on the weekend. They're not doing it on a 1200 calorie diet. So if you didn't know how they were doing it, this is how they are doing it. They are showing you the higher calorie, the higher food days. You can't work that stuff in every single day. You can have anything within reason, but if you wanna have a larger quantity, you can do it with calorie cycling and still lose fat and still lose weight. If I'd have known how to do this seven, eight years ago, I would have been done it.